What's up guys, welcome back to That So Dead. So today we will be reacting to Fourth Impact covering Emotion by Destiny's Child. Now, I'm not gonna waste any time. Let's just go ahead and get into this. Make sure you go ahead and like and subscribe. Let's go. Ooh, it looks like they're in the dressing room getting down. Ooh, this is a raw down cover. No production. Ooh. Ooh. over their voices especially you ma'am those harmonies are still tight though I love covers like these they're so real Oh my god, this is on the spot. This is so good. Raw talent. I love that. I love that vocal. That rings it. Yeah. Because ain't no way they just sat up there and did that so casually. Did you hear the tightness of the harmonies? How they harmony, 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 unison. Like stack the harmonies on top of each other. Like this, and this is what I mean. And this is what I mean. Because if one person was singing the song right now, it would not be executed the way that you would normally hear. Now, obviously this is done by a girl group, right? But like also at the same time, it's like, wow. The way that you see all moving parts with a girl group, it's insane. Oh my goodness, that was so good. And that's definitely one of my favorite songs. And the fact that they were able to execute that. Again, it's the details, like the crescendos or the day crescendos where we need to be, or right here, we need to look, be a little bit lighter with the harmonies as we let the main vocal go ahead and do its thing. Or, you know, the background harmonies need to come up a bit more because they complement the main vocal. Like, it's just it, the arrangement, the arrangement. And it's like, you gotta know who needs to sing what part for that part to be executed the right way way you can't just give anybody any sort of parts be serious beyonce and kelly to begin with you can't just give anybody any parts okay period end of that end of discussion 
So I'm absolutely obsessed with that. That was absolutely one of my favorite covers. Actually, I, I that was genuinely one of my favorite covers because it didn't need all of that extra stuff. It didn't need all the mics. It didn't need the background. That was just true creativity right there in the moment. That was true artistry. That really showed me even more their capability on the fly. On the fly. Because that's not in a studio where you, you're taking multiple takes. Obviously, they could have probably redid certain parts and then stitched them together. Sure, whatever. But that's on the fly right there, baby. Like, that's behind the scenes. They're just doing that. So, I, Okay, I got more fourth impact to do. And if I keep on repeating myself in this video, I'm never going to get them done. So, I appreciate you. Make sure you go ahead and like and subscribe. And I don't know what the f*** is saying. Again, I'm hopping off here. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. Like, subscribe, and make sure you go ahead and check out Patreon if you can. And have a great day. Peace.